Hi, this is Greg Weeks for Sprint 6, so I'm just going to show you across the board what I have going on here. Hopefully it's apparent in my text file that I'm going to be spawning in five centipede segments. Let me just demonstrate that real quick. All right, we're loading into the game, and lo and behold, we have five centipede segments. Uh, can change that back real quick. All right, so let's change it to something absurd, like 25, just to demonstrate that I don't have any tricks up my sleeves. Let that compile. All right, 25. Let's go back to the default value of 12, so we can get on with the program here. Um, Alright, so I've also implemented the flyweight system. So as I'm killing these mushrooms here, you can see my score updating, and the centipede will bug out because I still don't have the uh, splitting implemented correctly. Um, but yeah, I just killed the spider, my score updated again. Um, so the command system is actually working as it should because I got 900 points because it was very close to the spider. And uh, he's actually spawning in every 10 seconds. So that means my game manager is working. Um, okay, so let's get out of that. Uh, so if I change this value here, I'm actually going to start as player 2. So you'll see the score on the right-hand side change to 0, 0. And I'm actually using a joystick configuration right now. Um, so I plugged in my PS4 controller. I don't know if... Yes, it's working. Fantastic. So the score is actually updating. Um, I was pretty surprised by that. <laughs> I didn't expect this to work. Um, but yeah, player two is functional. The, the centipede splitting is absolutely not functional, as you can see. Um, but yeah, it's on the opposite side of the screen, and there's a method in uh, player two, which inherits from a base player class. Um, that sticks the score on the other side of the screen and uses a different uh, input mapping. So yeah, the, the controls are, are really buggy on my PS4 controller because I don't know exactly how to deal with them. I wasn't anticipating dealing with them, but it works, so I'm pretty happy with that. All right, um, make sure I'm still recording. Good. So uh, let's go over this real quick. So I created a player manager. Um, which essentially chooses between player one and player two. I don't have the AI implemented yet, um, but in player one, uh, I am initializing the the flyweights uh, system. Basically, that's pretty much all I'm doing in, in these classes that are derived from player. Um, so player dot h uh, is the parent class for player one and two, obviously, and it holds all of this data: the mushroom field, the ship input, the font uh, level score and all of the uh, the flyweight information. Uh, so I also created a game manager, and it's probably doing too much right now. Um, it, it's doing a lot with the uh, heads-up display, uh, too much with the flyweight system. Um, so that's kind of how I'm implementing it through, through the game manager. Um, but yeah, there are some essential functions here, like reading the file from the wave manager, which I'll show you in a minute. Uh, yeah, so it's mostly doing flyweight stuff, but the game manager is here, and it is it is ready to rumble. So where is wave manager? Ah, I have a separate window. Okay. Um, yeah, so this is possibly the most painful thing that I've ever written since high school. Uh, I've got a while loop uh, for getting the line. I'm using a bunch of standard libraries here. A while loop, if statements, for loop, uh, to, to parse through the text in this file. And it's just, I, I hate it so much, and I need to fix this. Um, but yeah, I'm trying to be as uh, as defensive as I possibly can in terms of what designers are going to put in this file. Um, maybe I should be less defensive and just to favor um, performance, but yeah, this, this is how I'm doing it. I'm not exactly proud of it. Um, okay. So yeah, that about sums it up. You can see a little bit of the flyweight uh, system that I have going on here. Um, but yeah, I'm still a little behind because I have to um, figure out the centipede segments, but I, I'm i pretty sure I completed everything for this week. If, if I didn't, I, I guess I'll find out when you create me. All right, that's about it.